Walt Kurtz was one of the most outstanding officers this country's ever produced. He was brilliant. He was outstanding in every way. And he was a good man, too. A humanitarian man. A man of wit and humor. He joined the Special Forces. And after that, his uh, ideas, methods, became and sound. And sound. Now he's crossed into Cambodia with this mountaineered army of his that worship the man like a god and follow every order, however ridiculous. Well, I have some other shocking news to tell you. Colonel Kurtz was about to be arrested for murder. I don't follow, sir. Murder too. Kurtz had ordered the execution of some Vietnamese intelligence agents, men he believed were uh, double agents. So he took matters into his own hands. Well, you see, Willard, in this war, things get confused out there. Power, ideals, the old morality, and practical military necessity. But out there with these natives, it must be a temptation to be God. Because there's a conflict in every human heart between the rational and the irrational, between good and evil. And good does not always triumph. Sometimes the dark side overcomes what Lincoln called the better angels of our nature. Every man has got a breaking point. You and I have them. Walt Kurtz has reached his. And very obviously he has gone insane. Yes, sir. <clears throat> Very much so, sir. Obviously insane. Your mission is to proceed up the Nung River in a Navy patrol boat. <clears throat> Pick up Colonel Kurtz's path at New Mung Ba. Follow it. Learn what you can along the way. When you find the colonel, infiltrate his team by <clears throat> whatever means available. And terminate the colonel's command. Terminate the colonel. He's out there operating without any decent restraint, totally beyond the pale of any acceptable human conduct. And he is still in the field commanding troops. Terminate with extreme prejudice. You understand, Captain, that this mission does not exist nor will it ever exist.